Greetings and salutations, viewers. Looking back now, I realized it's been exactly one year since I started making Let's Plays. I want to say thank you to all my viewers. I really do enjoy knowing people enjoy watching the videos I make. That aside, I wanted to do something different today. I looked through my inbox and came up with a list of questions I'm often asked. That's right, I'm making a frequently asked questions video. And y'all can watch me play a Toho game while I'm talking. So let's get to those questions. What emulators do you use? I play a lot of different games, so I use a lot of emulators. For Super Nintendo games, I prefer SNES 9X. ZSNES is good for net play, but other than that, I prefer SNES 9X for most everything. For Turbo Graphics games, I use Magic Engine, but be aware it isn't a free program. For NES games, I use NES Topia. For PlayStation, I use EPSXE. For Genesis and most everything else Sega, I use Gens Plus. However, for Lost Vikings, I use K-Fusion, since it has a non-Kylera netplay which lags to heck and back. For anything on an actual console, I use a Dazzle, which also is not free. What programs do you use to record, edit, or do whatever? I record videos with Hypercam. It's the most reliable thing I've found, but it isn't free. To edit audio, I use CoolEdit 2000, which is an old program, also not free. You actually can't get it legitimately anymore. There have been a lot of updates to the program, and even buyouts and name changes, but for my purposes, 2000 is as good as it gets. Lastly, I use Windows Movie Maker to combine, compress, and overall edit videos. It's free, comes with a computer, and works nicely once you figure out what you're doing. Where do you find these games? This is kind of tricky. I grew up with all these old consoles, so I played most of these games as a kid. Other than that, I'd say that most people keep their ears open for all the new games and consoles coming out. I, on the other hand, am just not all that big on current generation games. So my ears are instead open to the obscure. And let me tell you, I'm yet to play a lot of the odd games I know of. What kind of games do you like playing? For the most part, old school platformers, adventure, and exploration games. I love games like A Link to the Past and Super Metroid. I don't dislike current games either, but I find it takes a lot for me to like one. I like unique, innovative games like Katamari Damacy and Okami. Can I request a game? Of course you can. I love getting requests. No guarantee how fast I'll get to it, though. I've got a lot lined up. However, if you request a well-known game, or a game just not in my style, I probably won't play it. Also, don't demand I play a game and don't request it over and over. The more annoyed you make me, the less likely I am to do it. Will you play Kirby Superstar Ultra? No. Will you play I Wanna Be The Guy? No. I don't like how everyone always says it's the hardest game ever. It isn't. The game was intentionally made to be artificially difficult, killing you without warning or making you do the same stupid jump over and over. That just ticks people off, and once you know what's coming, it isn't that bad. If you want a really difficult game, look at what I'm playing now. I'm playing this on easy, by the way. There are three harder difficulties some of which give me an aneurysm just watching, and this is far from the hardest Toho game. What game are you playing next? Stay tuned and find out! Now from here, this FAQ will probably be turning into a bit of a rant. Will you do a co-op with me? For the most part, no. I'm not going to do a co-op with someone I don't know. I'm not the kind of person who loves co-ops and will jump on every opportunity to do one. I do them sparingly. Really, if you have to ask me if I'll do one with you, the answer is probably no. Will you accept my friend request? Now, I never really understood the whole friend thing on YouTube, and for the longest time just approved anything sent my way. I don't do this anymore, however, and as soon as I'm done posting this video, 
I'm actually going to be going through my friend list and really cleaning it up. Sorry folks, but if you're in there, you'll probably be removed. Will you mention my name or do a shout-out? No. If you've done something that warrants a thanks, maybe. But in this case, I'll probably do it without your asking me. When's the next video coming out? For anybody who's paying attention, this is a stupid question. I upload a video a day, sometimes a little more if I feel it necessary. On the off chance I miss a day, it's because I have a life. A new video will probably be up the next day. Do you mind getting messages? I enjoy getting messages. I can't guarantee I'll always respond, though. Also, please don't ask stupid questions. The more effort you put into finding the answer yourself, the more inclined I am to help. You missed an item in this one video! I don't care. I probably didn't care about it when I was recording, which is why I missed it. Now sometimes it was genuinely well hidden and I didn't know about it, in which case I'm happy to learn about it. But please check other comments, if it's been pointed out a dozen times already, you don't need to tell me about it. How do you do this move in this game? Watch the videos and pay attention. Anything I do that isn't obvious, I'll explain how to do in video. I've been asked how to rewind time in Bunny Must Die for crying out loud. The less effort you put into trying to find the answer yourself, the less likely I am to answer. Can you give me a ROM or tell me where to get a ROM? No. And this goes for anything, not just ROMs. I'm not handing out save games, emulators, nothing. If I want to give it to you, I'll post a link in one of the videos. I won't tell you where to get ROMs either. Not only is it easy enough to find them if you Google it instead of asking me, but it's actually illegal for me to give you anything or tell you where to get it. Can you help me with a technical problem? This is a vague topic, but I've been asked a lot of questions about things completely unrelated to my videos. Of all people to ask, why was I asked how to make multiple playlists? Why was I asked how to download this specific file whose type your computer didn't recognize? I make videos of me failing at video games and people laugh at me, very rarely with me. I'm not a technical help group. There are much better places to go than me for this kind of thing. Now, I want to apologize for sounding like a jerk at times. By all means, I'm not normally like this. You'd be surprised at the amount of stupid I'm exposed to on a regular basis, and dealing with it doesn't exactly brighten my day. All the ranting aside, the final thing I want to say I'm doing is finally enabling channel comments on my page. I know this is asking for trouble, so they'll be a little more highly monitored than video comments, but have at it. I hope you enjoy what I have in store in the future, because I don't intend to stop anytime soon. Have fun, everyone. I wish you all a good time. What? Son of a...